Hello, welcome to Tong's Toy Box. My name is Ryan and this is the first episode for this channel. This channel is going to be dedicated to unboxing all the toys in my collection and the first set of toys we're going to be checking out is Killer Clowns from Outer Space Funko Pop set. Let's start off with Slim since he was the first to be released last year during the fall convention. Let's take a look at the outside box. A little bit about Slim, as I said, it was from last year's fall convention. Uh, it is better known as the New York Comic Con. So this guy was retailed at about 75 to 80 ringgit on pop culture. It was not released in Malaysia because uh, none of the major Funko Pop suppliers brought it in. Currently, it is valued at about 300 on eBay, 300 ringgit on eBay for this variant and for the New York Comic Con sticker it's going up to about 400 to 450 ringgit for this pop. Let's take a look at the details. So for this guy, it's one of the first pops that looks different or rather it's different from most of the other pops that you've seen so as you can see from the head sculpt check out his wrinkles that's the first thing that pops out for me the finishing in the wrinkles the smile on his face usually the pops come with no mouth but this one has a nice creepy smile big nose as well as his orange hair his eyebrows in makeup it's also a nice touch and we go down to the body on his arms there are details here markings and he's holding his uh, balloon ray gun as well as a bag that he carries around to put his popcorn nice pink jumpsuit and the head is rotatable second thing we're going to take a look at would be jumbo Jumbo was released this year in May. May or June together with these three guys. So let's take a look at Jumbo first. Now, okay, Jumbo is the second version or rather the second pop to come out from this line. He is shown to have his mallet and his pose doing this. Alright, let's take a head sculpt check. This guy's head does not turn, also filled with wrinkles and a nice big smile. His eyes are fully black though and you look at it, it looks like a very chilled out alien clown that knows you're going to be in trouble. This guy is bigger than the other pops. He weighs about two times more than Slim. As you can see the size comparison. This is one very big Funko Pop. I like the details on the collar. It's not just a plain collar, there's like cracks everywhere. And his body is wearing a pink, eh hey, no, not pink, purple jumpsuit with blue color designs on it. Mallet on the back. And his finger looks like he's flipping you off from this angle, but actually it's just because Pops have four fingers. Next up, we're gonna take a look at Shorty. Shorty retails for 55. I got this from Legendary Toys in MCOP Mall because I don't think Sheldonette is bringing this guy in. So we're gonna have a look at details on this guy as well. Now Shorty is the smallest guy but also the guy with the cheekiest looking face look at that head sculpt same thing wrinkles everywhere but this one has small little detail if you can see the veins on the head makes it look extra extra freaky you know like his head being too big for his body all the veins all popping out and he has on a bright yellow jumpsuit with 
boxing gloves. This guy's head rotates. And that's about it for Shorty. And lastly, to finish off the set, we have Spikey. Spikey also retails for 55 If you can't get him locally, you can still pre-order these three guys. Not pre-order, you can still order these three guys from any websites that sell Funko Pop in the US. Probably can get it from Pop Culture as well. They're gonna be ranging from 55 probably even cheaper, 40 Depends if you can get like discount codes. So here we have Spikey. Spikey, as you can tell, got his name from his hair. This one comes with green eyes. Nice bright color and similar to Jumbo, his smile is creepy. It's like he knows something that you don't know. Nice big eyebrows. His hair is like super spiky. And you can also see his nice big ears. Now let's take a look at his body. He's holding a translucent balloon dog and Check out his collar. His collar is also translucent so you can actually see through it. And finally we move on to his star spangled cream jumpsuit. Very nice details. Honestly, I feel like this set has a potential to be a grail set one day. Especially for horror collectors. If you haven't catched the movie yet, it's... You know one of those bad horror films that so bad that it ends up becoming like a comedy film? Yeah, that is Killer Clouds from Outer Space for you. Again, my name is Ryan and this was Tonk's Toy Box. Thank you and have a good day, evening, afternoon or night. Goodbye.